Hello. Yeah, what's 95 Hello, Yeah, this is Aunt Rose. I want to order a pizza pie. Yeah, what can I get for you? I want a, like the, the nice fresh mozzarella and a homemade sauce. And uh, I'm going to call Kevin. He makes a good pizza. Okay, we're over at Aunt Rose's apartment in New York City and we're gonna make her a pizza pie. You know why? Because the pizza out there is just too expensive. Before we do anything, uh, we're gonna have to make sure that our oven is hot. Now, this oven is a, is a very old oven. Uh, so, I'm gonna turn it on. You have to light it by, uh, by hand. Oh! Oh, I tell you, that's always scary, lighting the oven. Always scary. Uh, you know, you smell the gas coming out. You just don't know what's going on. I just have a regular frying pan here. First, we have to put a little bit of olive oil. You got to put a little bit of olive oil in your pan. All right, there we are. Oh, that's coming up good. And I use a, uh, a virgin olive oil. All right, that's about enough. You know, I don't have much in there. And then we're going to chop up some garlic. And look at the instruments that I'm using. Look at the instruments that I'm using in the kitchen. They're very small, very tiny, very tiny. It looks like I have large hands, doesn't it? All right, that's good. All right. You want that to brown. And then I have some fresh tomatoes. I've already cored them. I'm going to use three tomatoes. I'm just going to cut them up in chunks. And you can do this. This is not hard to do. I'm not asking you to slice the thinnest tomato. No, I'm not. I'm just actually, you know, asking you to cut them up. Cut them up. Nice, big, chunky tomato sauce. All right. And this cooks up very quickly. Very quickly. Right here, I have oregano. Fresh oregano. Look at that, huh? Who wants to be using the oregano that's been sitting on the shelf for like 30 years, you know? I got some nice fresh oregano. Put it in your sauce. A little bit of salt. And fresh ground pepper. All the chefs use fresh ground pepper. They do. You like some fresh ground pepper on that? Fresh ground pepper? Fresh ground pepper. How do I know it's that fresh? How do I know? I'm not going to make, uh, you know, a big pizza, okay? I'm going to make a smaller one because I have smaller utensils. So I have, uh, I have my dough. Eating it and eating it and eating it, you know. And this is when, you know, the, the fellas are over from the frat. Uh, you can uh, say, hey, fellas, you want to eat some dough with me? <laughs> hey, fellas, you want to eat some dough with me? It's not gay. It's not, okay? You're just kneading dough. Don't be afraid to throw the dough. Just kind of work it slowly. And bounce. Have fun. Be an Italian. There you go. How do you like that? Oh, that's a nice. Oh, that's a nice. Oh, my God. Look at me. You throw the pie. Whoa. Take your pizza pan out. I like to put a little cornmeal and flour on the pan, you know? And then put your pizza on the pan. I've got a nice little pizza there. So I'm going to put it in the oven just for maybe about five minutes. It's now time to take the crust out of the oven. We just kind of pre-cooked it just a little bit, you know. And uh, there we go. Oh, that, oh, boy. That's beautiful. That's nice. So we've got our tomato sauce. We're going to dress it with that. Very simple. And you remember making that tomato sauce? Okay. So you just take the mozzarella cheese, you cut it up, you put it on the pie. Just cut them up. Doesn't have to be fancy cutting. You don't have to have a big knife. I use a serrated knife because it gets through the mozzarella cheese a little bit better. So our mozzarella cheese is all cut. I'm going to dress the pizza and we're going to put it in the oven. That looks nice. The pizza's almost done. Okay, I have a nice high oven. I have about 550 degrees here. It's a real old oven and it's really hot. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was quick. Didn't burn myself. All right, remember to pull it down carefully. Okay, the pizza is ready and we're going to take it out of the oven. 
Oh my God, that looks beautiful. Remember to use your pot holders. Remember to use your pot holders. Okay. It's oh my God, that, that is beauty. All right. Why don't we put it on our cutting board? Let it cool just a bit. I'll show you the back side of it. I'm just going to keep this in here. That's because it's it's a hot plate. So uh, my pizza is ready. Let's just take a look at the back side. I'm going to show you that. Oh God, that's hot. Okay, I'm just going to kind of pick it up like that. Look at the back side of that. Isn't that nice? I've got a little fresh basil I'm going to put on top. Got to put that on. That really smells great. I like the rolling knife. It's nice. It doesn't work all the time. All right. There we are. We have two beautiful slices of pizza. And we're going to serve this up to Aunt Rose. And she's just going to love it. It's like a real Italian pie. Really good. Yeah. Cooking with Kevin is fun.